Hi guys, it is an absolutely unbelievably spectacularly gorgeous day here in the end times in paradise in Garfield, Texas where there's only one of the last remnants of a of a uh, what shall we call them of a persistent contrail going over the skies of Austin, Texas on this spectacularly gorgeous, uh, what are we, Tuesday, March 26, 2019, I believe. So, uh, oops, fished the wrong thing there. Uh, so I'm just sitting here under the cottonwood tree, under this glorious cottonwood tree, trying to recover from about a week of acting like Jair Bozo Naro in my uh, in my backyard, just catching up. You know, guys, I'm uh, I'm uh, I've kind of dropped the comments of the day. I need to get back on the comments of the day. So I'm just sitting here catching up on some comments. It used to take me five minutes to read my comments. Now between my two channels, good God, I can spend an hour. And uh, anyway, uh, Let's see, I wanted to uh, particularly share a comment from former tribes member and conspiracy uh, chemtrail wacko Lisa Roach. Yes, who says to me, thanks for the clarification on your weather warfare position. Unsubscribed blah 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 my response to our former uh unalert tribes member yes one more chemtrail wacko so threatened so threatened by an opposing viewpoint that they have nothing more to hear from anyone who does not swallow their religion hook line and sinker I have lost two personal friends who have declared to me that they cannot be friends any longer with anyone who does not believe chemtrails are real. Chemtrail wackos are some of the most pathetic, narrow-minded religious zealots on the planet, and I have nothing but contempt and pity for them. What a loss to the tribe. One more clueless fucking moron down the tubes. So goodbye, Lisa Roach. You can go hang out with your fucking little uh, chemtrail wackos over there on Dane Wigington or Dutch Senses or Alex Jones. I don't guess Alex still has a thing. You know, this whole thing about chemtrail wackos, uh, you know, every time I make the mistake of posting one of these, you know, I always wait around for the people uh, to unsubscribe. Now, for instance, right, right here below Lisa is Osama number five weighing in on 5G. Now, Osama number five and I, uh, I honestly, Osama, I honestly don't even know where you are on chemtrails. Now, Osama is a little bit more down the conspiracy rabbit hole than I am. Uh, you know, uh, I am, for instance, a 9-11 truther, and Osama thinks that no planes ever hit the World Trade Center, as he shared with us today, and unbelievably, Osama number five and I can be friends. Uh, let's see, and of course Mark J, uh, my buddy out in New Mexico. Uh, for instance, Mark is a vegan. Okay, he is a vegan, and I am not. And 
miraculously, Mark J uh, has enough self-respect and backbone uh, and balls, as does Osama number five, that they can still be friends with somebody who does not share their religion. And this shit with chemtrails is, 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 is just, I mean, when you take all of the uh, conspiracy theories and combine them together, I have never experienced this religious fervor. I mean, they're, they're worse than, than radical vegans. Uh, I honestly am not aware in, in, in how many years on YouTube have I ever uh, lost a subscribe a, a radical vegan subscriber because I eat meat? You know, I, I'm not sure I've ever lost a subscriber, although uh, we did lose Andy Gardner for about six months because I do believe on some level 9-11 was an inside job, uh, although I also believe that the planes did hit the buildings. Uh, I do not swallow the bullshit mainstream media version of, of the events, but apparently my beliefs in 9-11, the fact that I eat meat, uh, and, and or, or I could go on with this shit that somehow these uh, th these people who do not believe in every single thing that I believe in still listen to this channel. I, I have never had a friend in my entire life outside of these two chemtrail wackos that just literally flushed, uh, in one case, a 15-year friendship down the toilet when I was a chemtrail wacko, which for years, and I have all my videos still up here, when I was a chemtrail wacko, like, uh, like Miss Roach uh, here, uh, and a big follower of Dane Wigington, my friends both in real life and on uh, and my subscribers who did not agree with me, as far as I know, never uh, unsubscribed, and, and I certainly never lost the friendship of a non-chemtrail wacko when I was a chemtrail wacko. Like, so when I was a chemtrail wacko and these two friends of mine who were also chemtrail wackos, we were great friends. But then I pulled my head out of my ass, came back on this side of the fence, and at that point they were so threatened by this. I mean, it's unbelievable. Cause it's so threatened by this. The friendship was over because I did not... Uh, agree with them that chemtrails are some sort of conspiracy by the New World Order to depopulate us all or whatever the fucking, uh, wh whatever your flavor of chemtrail wackiness is. It, it never worked the other way. I have never lost a, a, a friend over 9-11. Uh, I've never lost a friend over the Kennedy assassination, probably because every one of my friends and anyone with a fucking brain. Uh, no, I, I even have a buddy who does not believe in the Kennedy assassination. And he and I are still buddies. We can somehow be friends because... Uh, he does not, because he does believe, I'm sorry, in the magic bullet theory, and I choose not to. We can still be friends. But the, the, these fucking chemtrail wackos, they really are pathetic. It really must be awful to be one of you, to be one of you folks. And I'm not saying that all of them are. I, I'm, I'm talking about the, the, the spineless, ballless ones because I understand there are that I do have subscribers on both channels 
who believe that chemtrails are real and we can have a fun, friendly debate and they are not so, so, j just so feeble-minded, so narrow-minded, so dogmatic in their, in their uh, religious fundamentalist beliefs. And I put them right up there with fucking ISIS. They really are. Uh, you, you know the, the, the ones I'm talking about. There, there's plenty of chemtrail wackos uh, on Humpty Dumpty Tribe and Collapse Chronicles that believe that chemtrails are real but can still, uh, you, you know, be in a, in a group of people where some people believe one thing and some people uh, believe something else. But to you know to be in a to to put yourself in a position where you are so threatened by by another person's belief, and, and I don't know this uh, Lisa Roach moron. I mean, I, I don't know the woman personally, uh, but my guess is that she and I probably don't agree on a lot of other things. But she didn't dump Humpty Dumpty Tribe because of anything else that I've ever said. It was the chemtrail thing. How fucking pathetic, you know, to be so fucking spineless and so goddamn unable to uh, y y you know to think for yourself that you that you're so fucking threatened by by somebody else who does not believe in, in your religion uh, good god how many friends uh, can, can you have walking around with your head stuck so far up your clueless fucking moron ass Goodbye, Lisa Roach. Uh, go climb back in the fucking crack that you came out of. What a fucking loss to the tribe. And uh, as long as I'm talking about uh, comments, I'm actually going to go over to Collapse Chronicles because someone had a uh, had a question. Uh, let's see, someone asking Sam Mitchell a question. Uh-oh, is it, uh, uh, okay, here we go. The question is coming from Dan Olson. <clears throat> Dan wants to know, who keeps giving your videos thumbs down? Why? My answer, uh, th this is how I had to delicately phrase it over uh, on Collapse Chronicles. The answer to who keeps, who and keeps giving my videos thumbs down and why. The answer to your question, Dan, is the cadre of ALTs and spineless little cowards who I have banned from this channel. That's who. And if you don't know what an ALT is, you will have to figure it on your own because we don't talk about that subject on this channel, meaning Collapse Chronicles. Uh, would you get that squirrely But No barking. Sancho, the neighborhood doesn't want to hear your barking any more than they want to hear my ranting. Sancho, no barking. No barking. So, of course, an ALT is an ass-licking toady is who, uh, that's what an ALT is. The thumbs down on my channels, plural, have nothing to do with the content of the videos, unless, of course, they're about chemtrails. Uh, they have to do with the fact that the information was being offered by Sam Mitchell, or Hambone Littletail, as the case may be. Notice how I will post a 30-minute video, and within one minute, it will be getting thumbs down. These pathetic trolls who come from the Doomosphere itself, and 
the ass licking toadies, I can say what an ALT is, have nothing better to do with their puny, worthless little lives, and since they have been banned from spewing their hatred and ignorance on my channel, all they can do is hit the thumbs down button to show how pathetic and small minded they are. They are the true basket of deplorables out there. I hope that answers your question, amigo. Yes, little dog. Sancho and the Squirrely are having it out with each other. Anyway, uh, I just, I, I really do need to uh, just ban the, uh, I thought that I had. But obviously, uh, I need to figure out how to filter out the word chemtrail. Uh, the word chemtrail from uh, both of these channels. I, I have really heard enough from, from these uh, fucking pathetic religious zealots. You know, they embarrass me. Uh, they, they really do. They just embarrass me. Now, if you believe in chemtrails and have enough spine and balls uh, to actually uh, hang out with a group of people who may not believe in your religion, then you're welcome to stay over here. But uh, I really am going to figure out how to ban the word chemtrails from the comments section of uh, both my channels as I thought that I had done. Anyway, it looks like the persistent contrail has disappeared into the deep blue sky. Get out there and enjoy the chemtrail streaked skies in paradise while you still can. Bye guys.